What is Wuhan coronavirus? The Wuhan virus belongs to a family of viruses known as coronaviruses. These viruses, named for the crown-like spikes on their surfaces, infect mostly bats, pigs, and small mammals. But they mutate easily and can jump from animals to humans, and from one human to another. In recent years, they have become a growing player in infectious disease outbreaks worldwide. How is the virus spread among humans? Seven strains are known to infect humans, including the virus in Wuhan. They can be spread by coughing, kissing or making contact with saliva, Chinese officials say. Four of the strains cause common colds. Two other strains, however, have been extremely deadly, Severe Acute Respiratory Syndrome, known as SARS, and Middle East Respiratory Syndrome, or MERS, are coronaviruses. Coronaviruses, from animals to humans. Proteins on the outer shell of the virus allow it to latch onto cells in the host's respiratory tract. The protein's shapes are determined by the virus's genes. Coronaviruses can also jump directly to humans, without mutating or passing through an intermediate species. Researchers aren't sure from what animal the novel coronavirus originated or whether it passed through an intermediate species before infecting humans. What are the symptoms of illness and how do you know if you have it? Patients have had a fever, cough and other symptoms of pneumonia. Public health officials have developed diagnostic tests, which are being used to confirm whether a patient has the Wuhan coronavirus or another infection. Five major airports in the U.S. are screening arriving international travelers for fever, those who have one are then screened for other symptoms. How does the severity of the Wuhan virus compare with SARS and MERS so far? The Wuhan virus appears to be milder than SARS or MERS, though it has sickened some people severely and there have been deaths. MERS killed about a third of those infected, while SARS resulted in the deaths of about 1 in 10. By contrast, the mortality rate from the Wuhan virus is tracking at roughly 3%. Many patients who have died were over 60 years old, had other illnesses such as diabetes and were admitted to hospitals when their illness was advanced. Are there drugs to treat coronaviruses? There aren't any drugs or vaccines approved specifically for the Wuhan virus. Antivirals already on the market might treat the infection, which researchers say they will start to investigate. In addition, a few vaccine makers have recently said they would begin developing products targeting the Wuhan virus.